Hey hey guys, now we're gonna play The Silent Age, uh, which is a game I know very little about, but I'm very excited to get into. I didn't dare to go further into the game than this, um, in case that it would already start with some cutscenes or so, but uh, let's get into it. Let's see here. Oh, yeah, it only got here, but then, then I know. Then I know just... Yes, The Silent Age is a proper point and click game, that's what I know. Oh, let's see here. Yeah, and it was. Uh, it used to be on uh, a tablet or on mobile. But then they reworked it for uh, PC. So I'm very interested. It was on a sale and I'm ready to play. Uh, the present one. Uh, it looks like just another Tuesday as Joe sweeps down the floors at the anonymous cold office hallways. Then he notices the note. A meeting with the brass? Little does he know, but today is about to take a very dramatic turn. Let's start this. As you see, I think that's why the cursor is like this. Or maybe it's something. Let's start. Yeah, it was on sale and it looked kind of cool. So, 1965. Let's see here. Painter person. Painter person. 1968. Let's see. What happens? Oh. War. That's nice. Always fun. Guns and war and military. Let's see how this pans out. 1969. That's just one year after. Buffet all you can eat. Different types of jobs, different types of times in your life, am I right? Well, we all have straight different careers in our lives and so on. I wonder. No, I don't dare to touch anything. I just want to watch this. I don't want to accidentally skip. Was a dramatic sound? 1972. Let's see, okay. chapter one, the present. Oh yeah, it's definitely made for mobile. So let's see here. Where what I can see? Red access card reader. It's a red access card reader. It uses flat cards and other keys. This company is full of modern technology like that. Hmm. What a nice sales speech for this company. A uh, trash can? Nothing happens. An the door. Only the lab guys get to go down there. Oh, and Frank, of course. They all have red access cards. Who the frick is Frank? Sign. Two thousand pound maximum, clear level five, no exit from science labs, yes, yes. Let's go here and check. Walking along the road, walking along the road, let's see. Door. I wanna read a note first. It's a sticky note near the door. It says, Joe, Mr. Hill wants to see you. Frank. It's Frank person. It's my office. It says so in permanent mark right underneath the supply room sign. Ah, it's your office. Nice. But let's hear it. Blue access card reader. Tight security. That's why I was keeping my card in for nobody ever spy. I need my blue access card. Okay. Okay. Then I, I, I'm just I'm just taking everything out. Um, this is a bit new to play. I haven't really played any point and click games in a bit, and I haven't played it definitely on the channel. So this is fun. Let's hear. Oh. This is a very murky office. I love the art, but you know. I should get some light in here before I break anything. Yeah, I agree. Let's take the light bulb. Ooh, a light bulb, we got it! And, uh, play. I realize that my face will cover up the thing that says what I'm pointing at, but I'll read it for you guys, it's fine. And what do you say? It's my plague, it's too dark to read in here. Okay, yeah, I get it. Light. Okay, I need to change. Do I? It needs to repeat it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's the old good. Nice. Ah! We did it! Our first accomplishment in this game. So let's see what we got. Uh, what does the plaque say? Employee of the Month plaque. It's my award. I got it for helping out one of the lab assistants downstairs after he mishandled some barrels. I agreed to keep them there. Here. Oh. The award ceremony was sort of unofficial, and I was told to keep the plaque in my office so no one would get jealous. Hmm. 
Hey, rubber gloves. It's one of those fake rubber gloves used for cleaning things in the labs. Okay, good have. Uh, borax, critic acid, eye wash, bleach, and hands up. Some of the labels have peeled off, but I keep them in alphabetical order, so that's okay. Oh, okay. I think... I think I can't pick up anymore. Okay, let's see here. Uh, what's this blue note? Or oh, it's the access card! Yeah! It's the access card for the management floor. Okay, and these barrels. Do we have anything interesting to say? No, we don't. Do not. These barrels were brought here about a year ago. I don't mind them. I have plenty of space and they hardly smell at all, but... Did I say wrong? Were there two? I, I thought there were like two light bulb things, but one was completely dark. Okay, anyway, uh, never mind that. Um, let's go out, because now we have the blue access card. Now, let's walk out. So. Let's see here. Oh yeah, I need to, I need to actually pick the card. Let's... I love that noise. Permission to enter bridge, isn't it? <laughs> sign. What does the sign say? Okay, no, I'm not gonna... Tw 23rd floor offices. It's a top management floor where Mr. Hill's office is. Wait, what did the note say again? I'm sorry, he is the fast walker. So. Yo, Mr. wants to see. Okay, it was him we were gonna go to. Okay, top floor. Top floor. Ooh, let's see here. Art shop. This looks fancy. Modern art. Nice. The title reads Into It. Must be French. The title reads The Gest Out of Satin Veal. Just looks like a couple of colored boxes to me. Oh, modern art. The plant. It's a common rotondo number. I'm not a botanist or anything, but I used to have one at home that came with a little name tag. Oh, look, who's this lady? Secretary. I. Uh. Ah. Mm hmm. Oh, oh, there you are, sweetie. Mr. Hill's expecting you. Just walk right in. What's the matter, sugar? Cat got your tongue? Just get your honey in there. I thought I would have to read that, but okay. Yes, uh, you have an ashtray and some stuff and trash can, relatable, and the trash can is almost full. I'll empty it later. Yeah, because it's clean, right? But let's go in and leather padded door. Mr. Hill's office. Let's walk in and see what Mr. Hill wants. Company performance art. Oh! We had a good deal. I have no idea what this graph represents, but whatever it is, it seems to be going well. Yeah. This is... Yeah, because this is a gloomy world and world, so I'm very intrigued in this, Mr. Hill. Ah, Jasper. It's... It's, it's Joe, it's, sir. Ah, of course, Joseph. Uh, how long is it that you've been with this company, Joseph? About two years, sir. Ah, yes, then by now you must know that what we do here is very important. National security may be just a word to most people, Jasper, but for men like you and I, it means so much more. We see the people behind those words. We understand that it means the safety of every citizen in this country, not to mention the shareholders and the hard-working clerks and stakeholders at the government funding agencies. It also means a lot of pressure. A lot. And some men just... buckle. Which brings me to the main point of my agenda. A position just opened up and we're promoting you, Jasper. Promotion? That's nice. It, it, I'm... I'm s sir? Sir. Don't think the company doesn't notice its hard-working employees. We reward achievement yeah, but we're this going from like young man. Cleaner. And What's you've just kind made of... yourself a gold star. Uh, uh, this means that from now on, you will be in charge of not only yours, but Frank's assignments Who is too. Frank? That's right. That means downstairs lab sanitation, drain okay. assignments, the works, with all the clearance that entails. That's clearance a lot of responsibility. Get us we're a in here, Jasper. I, I thank you, sir. Uh, but what about Frank? Yeah. It's I know Frank. you made a great team, but Frank decided to pursue a different career oh, path this something morning. Something definitely. We wish him all the Frank. best. Oh, and of course you understand that we won't be able to present you with a fancy title or a miserable pay raise. This is a modern company, you understand. We like to keep a flat organizational structure here. I... So congratulations, Jasper. I bet you must be very excited to yes. get back to work with all your I new read. responsibilities. That's perfect, man. 
understandable. I won't keep you a minute longer. Here's your key card. Yes, exciting! Uh, a red phone. I'm just gonna check this out. I can usually tell success by the amount of phones people keep on their desks. I don't have a desk. <laughs> That's relatable. I do have a desk though, but it's very shaky. And uh, old. Even ashtray looks expensive. Oh, uh, and a plant. It's one of those rhododendron. Right? It's a remarkably stern looking plant. Even his plants are stern. Anyway. Anyway, yeah, my desk is not the most quality one, but yeah, I, I get the feeling. Now we have the extra lot of things, and I'm sure that is gonna put us in some compromising situations along the way. Um, so let's see, I'm just gonna check so Yes, everything's alright. So. Yeah, everything seems alright. I just wanna check so recording is fine and going. Fresh green is almost full. I'll end it later. Yes, yes, yes. Now we're gonna get the red access card. We go down and snoop. Who is this Frank? He seems to be like our buddy. And some of he pursued other career paths. I don't know if this is supposed to be it's the sixties, so I don't know if they're having like an alternative version or if it's just in the sixties, so I don't know what could have happened to Frank, really. but let's go in here. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, and Frank, of course, yes. Frank, Frank, Frank! Let's... Open sesame. Sesame. Yeah, it's sesame in the English to write, yeah. Let's go down. Spooky. Okay, not really spooky, I'm just a very afraid person. Let's... A drop of blood? Looks like blood. Maybe someone cut themselves or a lab animal got loose or something. Either way, I'll be the one mopping up this time. Uh, I am tin foil hat. It's a tin foil hat. Nice one too. This is all super concerning. Let's go out. I don't know what we're doing exactly, but I. Be looking for. Ooh, arch. Monitoring unit. Reminds me of that pong machine you used. They just got done at Isis. That thing's amazing. I've been down there almost every night of the hours it's set it up. Frank says it from a fry my brain, but I think it works just fine. Oh, the no, we're not even in the 60s. We're in the 70s now. Yeah. <laughs> Large processing unit. It's a big computer thing. I'm really not sure what it does. Dials. I took over for Frank during a sick day about a year ago. My sleeve snagged on one of these things and they closed down the labs for a day. Well, that sounds like something. I would Why? There's more blood. Is this blood train? This is no case of nosebleeds. It looks serious. I've got to show this to someone. Or... Well, show... Just follow? <gasps> it's locked. This is so shady. Access panel. It's broken! I'm not much of an engineer, but there seems to be something attached to two of the wires that clearly don't belong here. I could remove it and put the panel back in place if I had something to protect my hands. We do! We have rubber gloves! Let's see. Where do I put it? Got it! I removed the thing and pushed the panel back in place. Yes. We did a thing. So let's see here. This is not good because the blood trail led all the way here, but we need to explore. Maybe there are choices in this game so far. Is this gonna be very dark? Something fell out of the coat. Looks like a hand sheath. Polar is nine supercomputer. Note to self, don't touch anything. Um okay, yeah, noted. I, I don't like the red blinking lights, that's it. It looks like something a writer of a sudden science fiction movie. Caution. It's a very expensive data processing unit. It, it doesn't actually say expensive, but I think it's a fair guess. Warning sign to read caution and keep away from like liquid materials. I'm a bit sweaty, I should keep away from that thing. <laughs> uh, why do I, should I really follow this blood trail or should I? Uh, management needs to know about this. I need proof this time though. Ever since the stupid Halloween prank that science department pulled on me last year, I don't think they take me seriously again. I could go inside, but can I like use the handkerchief to show that there was blood down there?
Far out. It's one of those doors with two people have to turn keys at the same time to open it. Looks like something out of a secret agent movie. Only this one doesn't use keys, just buttons. That reminds me a bit about Quantum Break. Anyway, uh, let's hear. Uh, blood trail. Yeah, exactly. Okay, it was what I thought. I just didn't dare to try. Let's. Yes, let's go get to the management. I am sure our journey back would be calm and undangerous. Yes, I'm sure this will be fine. I'm sure Frank is alright. Uh, I don't like this. I have like 15 concerns right now. You know what? Before we get back to management, we're gonna. I was almost like. S managed to smash my glass of water over. But anyway, before we continue, we're gonna end this episode here because this is very exciting. And uh, yeah, but I wanna continue it another episode. So for now, can I pause? I just turn off the key. Okay, good. It's just here. Okay, good, good, good. I can continue. I was a bit worried. I just ruined everything. Anyway, but then we're run running this up, up, running this up here. So I'll definitely continue playing this because this is intriguing as f. So see ya.